Hello viewers, welcome to Elim TV, a station where you watch, and learn, and interact. Your tutor is Mr. Wanyoike, an agriculture teacher. Uh, we are in Form 2, Lesson 10. Our topic is Crop Production 2, and the subtopic is Types of Planting Material. Uh, on to the lesson objective. By at the end of this lesson, you will be able to, number one, define the, difference, the different vegetative material used during crop propagation. And number two, highlight the advantages and disadvantages of using vegetative material as a planting uh, material. Uh, advantages of using vegetative material in crop uh, production. The first advantage is fast maturity. The crops which are uh, grown or which are raised from uh, vegetative material normally take a very short time to mature as compared to those uh, where seeds are normally used. Then the second one, uniformity uh, in trait. Uh, the crops which are raised uh, from vegetative material, they have uniformity in physical appearance and also uh, the, the other characteristics. Uh, then number three, we have possible to do grafting. Uh, this is a method of a sexual uh, 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 propagation where one plant, uh, one root uh, uh, root crop, root stem, uh, can be used, uh, to, uh, can be grafted such that it will end up uh, producing uh, different varieties of crop uh, using uh, the this, this Zion. Uh, the Zion is placed on the root stock. For example, we have the lemon uh, root stock uh, and the, it is grafted with the Zion of um, uh, oranges and therefore you will uh, be in a position of getting oranges and lemon on the same uh, piece uh, of tree. Uh, then we have easier and fast uh, and fast uh, that is no dormancy. It means that uh, the seed uh, the, 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 when seeds are used uh, it will take a longer time to break the seed dormancy but in vegetative material there is no seed dormancy and therefore they are easier and fast. Then we have parthenocarpy. Uh, this is it means that um, the crops are, uh, are raised without fertilization taking place. For example pineapple it is very possible to uh, propagate the crops uh, where seeds are not uh, readily available. Therefore you can use the vegetative material in case of uh, pineapple and uh, bananas. Then uh, we have disadvantages of using vegetative material. We have no new varieties because uh, there will be no cross pollination and as we have said that uh, no fer uh, fertilization is, uh, will take place. Then difficult to keep vegetative material free from uh, diseases. Vegetative material are highly susceptible to uh, diseases and also pest attack. Then number three, highly perishable. Yes, because they have a lot of uh, water and therefore the water inside uh, them, they uh, provide a culture medium for the propagation of bacteria and therefore that's why they will end up spoiling very, very quickly. Then they are bulky and it, this is a challenge when it comes to storage and transportation and therefore it will increase uh, the cost of st uh, storage and also the cost of uh, the, the transportation because it will take a lot of space when it comes to transportation and also storage. And we go to the vegetative plant material. There are very various examples of vegetative plant materials that are used, normally used uh, in the farm during a crop uh, uh, propagation uh, through a sexual reproduction. The first one we have use of bulb, babilis, that is uh, you can use the sizo plant, uh, that is uh, in sizo plant as it is well illustrated for you. Then we have use of crown, and uh, suckers and slips that is applied in pineapple. Then we have use of split 
and it is well uh, applied in uh, establishment of pastures, uh, crops, the, for example, grasses. Then we have uh, stem tuber. Uh, I, I, when it comes to propagation of uh, Irish potato, you can use the stem tuber. Uh, then you have we can use the the vines uh, that is another method when it comes to sweet potatoes then you can also use cuttings and in cuttings the some of the crops which are raised through cuttings use of cuttings as vegetative material we have the sugar cane is well illustrated for you then we have cassava also uses cuttings uh, as a vegetative material uh, that marks the end of today's lesson and and I can forget, I cannot forget to leave you with assignment and it will be in form of two questions. Number one, uh, state any five types of vegetative material used uh, during crop uh, propagation. And number two, we have defined the term grafting. Then uh, the reference you can refer to us to, from secondary agriculture student book two and for more information, if you'd like to clarify something from us, you can reach us through the following addresses. You have uh, through SMS using that number which is well displayed for you. Then you can use the YouTube at Elimu TV. Then you can reach us through Facebook at Elimu TV. Then finally, you can reach us through Twitter. You can tweet us at um, Elimu underscore TV underscore KE. Thank you for joining me in my lesson. Please uh, stay tuned for more information.